How do I complete pre-bankruptcy credit counseling? Find out today on Bankruptcy Basics. Hi, I'm Kate Bass, bankruptcy paralegal here at Arm Lawyers in Attorney Patrick Best's office. Today we're going to review how to take the online credit course. The online credit course is required for all debtors to complete prior to the filing of your bankruptcy. You will receive a certificate that needs to be filed along with your petition. Failure to do so will mean immediate dismissal of your case, so it's important that you take it prior to filing and that our office has a copy. On the top of the flyer you receive will be a code, Best Bankruptcy, easy to remember. As long as you put that information into the website when you take the course, the certificate should automatically be emailed to our office. We do suggest you hold on to a copy that you are emailed in case it gets lost in the mail and we for some reason don't have it. That way you can forward it to us. The course takes about an hour and any information requested you should be able to answer easily. The answers that you supply do not need to match the amounts that you listed on our questionnaire. So don't feel like you need to call us and ask what you put down for your electric bill. We will not receive any additional documentation from the credit company except for the credit certificate, indicating you completed the course. The course is district specific. There's a list of counties and their associated districts on the back of the credit counseling flyer. There's also maps on our website. So if you have any questions as to what county your district corresponds to, please feel free to check out our website. You can also contact us and we'll let you know. States like Maryland and New Jersey, those are state specific. They don't have districts, but states like Pennsylvania and New York are district specific by county. It is also not geographically accurate. Monroe County here in Pennsylvania is in the easternmost portion of the state, but we're in the middle district. So don't let your geography lead you to selecting the wrong district. If you do select the wrong district, there could be a delay in us receiving the certificate. You will need to get it reissued for the correct district. So please be sure you have the right information prior to starting that course. Should you have any questions while you're working on the course, please don't hesitate to reach out. Our office is always here through email and by phone. We look forward to helping you.